Bro, I need, I need a new drone. This thing is, if anyone wants to buy this, let me know, but I need an upgrade. But anyways, so today I'm trying to go out and fly because in the bay has just been these crazy like cyclone floods everywhere. And <laughs> I don't know why I'm laughing. It's not necessarily funny, but there's some funny ass clips I'll show you right here of what's been going on in the bay. Um, but today has some it's pretty nice weather, so I'm gonna try to go fly. But anyways, for this video, we have some pretty good conversations, some good sit downs with people. Uh, as far as like archive fashion conversations and Ben Salaga, the Bella Kalala, you know what I mean? Talking about a little bit about that special guest pickups from the homies and that's what it is. So let's enjoy the video. Oh, also it ain't easy, right? I haven't said that in a really long time, bro. It ain't, I've been trying to tell people it ain't easy for a long time, but it really ain't easy being keezy. You know what I mean? <laughs> headed to uh, the tailor. I haven't hit the tailor in a long time. I got these like Riot Hill t-shirts. I have like four of them <laughs> that I purchased and uh, they're just a little long on me, but we're gonna bring them down there. You view me and um, chop up the bottom real quick. It's actually been a long time since I've been here. Let's see if she's inside. Hello. What happened? Why are you so old? The hair, yo, now is you can call it. Oh, you haven't seen my hair? Yeah, I see it. Yeah, it's yeah, a long time. This made a couple months ago now. The hair, that's so cute. Yeah. <laughs> How's everything? Everything good. Everything you. good. Somehow somebody come in here. Uh, I buy this from you. Okay, I buy that from you. <laughs> oh my God, the jean, you know? Really? Any jean, and then they told me, okay, I buy from him. I buy from him. I buy from him. <laughs> <laughs> and then I, oh god he sell a lot of gold yeah 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 yeah, yeah they good. that's what i do for a living now that's a business good yeah so it's, it's okay nice. it's working mm -hmm. nice. yeah <laughs> <laughs> that's when you look good too okay oh thank you you, you too you look good? really good uh -huh. you look good <laughs> can you open the head let me see it just oh here. it's growing out though so, already no, let me see it the color oh that's so cute Blonde. i love it yeah, love yeah, it yeah. Long. Uh -huh. but i have to that's cut it, it off soon mm -hmm. Nice. Uh, it doesn't look as good, you know. You gain little bit weight. Huh? You gain weight little bit. I That's did. Nice. Yeah, not too much, but just oh. little bit. Make it you're young, okay? Young than before. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now what you did through today? Uh, same thing. I always get just cut mm -hmm. it like inch and a half from the bottom. Just inch and a half, right? Yeah, yeah. From all, mm -hmm. all of the bottom. Yeah. Uh -huh. His nickname. K. Uh huh. K. E. E. -E. K -E -E. So one more E and then Z Y. -E. Thank you. Okay. 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 I'll be here. Okay. <laughs> nice seeing you. Bye bye. Oh, dude, she's so nice. What the fuck? I haven't been there in so long. It's been um, actually, I haven't been here in like half a year. I just haven't tailored a lot of because previously I was tailoring hella t-shirts and shit. You know what I mean? Like bringing them, chopping the bottom. But the ones I brought today, it's not my brand, you know? I was doing like the Uniglo Airism, but then ever since I made the blanks of my own blanks, it's like I damn near got free t-shirts. Like I can, I could buzz out a new, brand new t-shirt for myself like every day until the stock runs out, you know what I mean? But you know, bless her soul though. She's a, she's a really nice lady. Shout out to the, there was like a couple people from the pop-up and they were like, oh, you go to, uh, you know, on Key Street in San Jose to Lay's out in Eldo's, right? I was like, yeah. They are like, oh, I've been going to her forever. This and that, woo-woo. And I was like, dude, that's crazy. Anyways, love her. And uh, we're going we're gonna to move on from this. About to hit this blue jeans real quick. Bruh, bruh. Thank you. 
finger. <laughs> Got me a little thermal. I actually don't, I don't own any thermals right now. I wanted to actually make a thermal, but then I'm like, why don't I just go buy it at the thing? Shout out to Shaka. Shaka wear. You feel me? Who knows, man? It'd be cold in these streets. No shirt, no thermal. I brought this from Villain Lonnie. What's up, fool? What you do, bro? Ah, you come bearing gifts. Yes. Merry Christmas. Yes, yeah, perfect. <laughs> police. Police. No, no, no. <laughs> but uh, I brought two sizes for you guys mean? to try on. It's for the uh, the wool barn. Oh, oh, which shit, you just posted. Yeah. I saw it online. You got like that, that like uh, wax. I don't feel to it, yeah. Lonnie here? Oh, he's here. Yeah, yeah. Ha, fool. Huh? He just got it. <laughs> oh yeah, what size are you, bro? Merry Crema, fool. Merry Crema, fool. I'm a large, I think. Yeah, <laughs> knew it. That's why I bought it. That's why I brought it. <laughs> like, I, was like, I know he had XL, but even if he's not there, I'm dropping off a large. I'm dropping off a large. <laughs> Do you want the small size? You gotta have a sleeve. You know what I'm saying? I want to be real cozy. <laughs> but yeah, it comes with, uh, I mean, you've seen it before. So you think Bill would be not the same size? I don't know. It basically is the same exact size as the varsity. What? <laughs> it ain't hugging. You <laughs> hug me, bro. This motherfucker nice. I use this right now. I mean, you're in between. You can you can hang on to it and see which one you really want. Sure, bro. It's like you ain't getting this back. Right. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. Bro. I don't like, know why I said that. You want to give me two jackets? Just say you want to give me two jackets. All right. They said cool. Oh yeah, you can put it in. There's there should be two slots. So you can put it in here to cover up the whole thing, and then there's halfway so you can see the jacket. Ooh. Too fancy for me, bro. <laughs> what were you saying, though? 2019, man. <laughs> Wait, hold on. Let me see the comment. My style made a clothing line. You took my style and made a damn clothing line out of it. said, look how you was dressing pre-pandemic and after. But click the profile, though. Tell me this is a troll. This is a troll. No, 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 no that's, no, that's a comment. It. What? <laughs> Boy, you got on skinny jeans, brother. All right. Who is it? I don't know. It got to be trolling. I don't it fucking know. It got to be trolling, bro. Nothing he has on his face resembles anything you got going on. I don't right. even wear dunks. <laughs> I don't even wear Jordan 1s. Nah. He, he, he right. took my style and made a damn clothing line of it. Look how he was dressing before the pandemic and during it. Bro, we have... He got super specific, too. We have fucking receipts of how you've been dressing <laughs> since the beginning of time. Right? He follows you. Yeah. He, he troll, he troll. It yeah, gotta he, be. He wanted to, he wanted to click. He, he, he got it. He, he got it. He, gave it. he got super specific, so. I don't think you dress any different other than you just wearing your own shit now. Yeah, you literally you don't wear anything but his important. Yeah. Exactly. Like, I'll just need to make boxers and all the rest, and now I'll be, I'll be full on. Ooh, we gotta get some heavy core socks, cuz. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah. No, I'm thinking about a beanie, bro. Oh, I'm, I'm working on one of those for sure. Do a beanie with a brim on it, though. <laughs> that, I was thinking about that. Do a beanie with a brim. That's what, a corner store. No, style, and, and a peacoat. Oh, my mother. You got brim beanie is bad. You gotta If you wore a brim beanie back in the day, you automatic felony by the time you're at least 25. I was wondering why my daddy didn't buy me one of them, bro. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going to lie, I have one too. <laughs> I have one. I definitely have one, bro. It's dark times. Got to rock it with the black Air Forces, black, South Poles, black, and black, black Pete Coat. Oh, yeah. the South Poles, bro. <laughs> That's the nasty part is niggas used to wear that with LeBrons. <laughs> like, that's gross. <laughs> Don't wear LeBrons in clothes. <laughs> shit's ugly. It's fucking disgusting. <laughs> we haven't forgot about you niggas wearing LeBrons. We have not forgot. With the visor B. With the LeBron. Whoa, bro, oh, that's that crazy. Y'all was disgusting out here wearing LeBron <laughs> in these streets like that, bro. That's crazy. That's not a casual shoe. And you gotta you gotta wear the, the visor tilted too. Niggas is <laughs> <laughs> Off to the side oh, as God. if it makes any difference. Have I seen that t-shirt before? I like that one. That's nah, like because you have two you have two different ones, huh? Yeah, this was actually uh gifted to me by um you feel me. Uh, shout out to bruh. Damn, all that? Alright man, yeah man, it's been a minute. We ain't, I haven't showed any new pickups in a while. Keezy hit me up, so uh. It's been like four months. Right, so these we got. These are nice. I just fucking got them. This is cool, I like the I tone. Don't the I haven't even been following anything Jordan, so I don't no. even know what's. These are the Taxi Jordan 1s. Mm. Oh, you've worn these, huh? No, no. No? Oh. Mm -hmm. And you, you've been covering all these off of actual release? None of this is resold. Oh, I think these are the. that dropped not too long ago. You have a gang of lows now. 
I, I kind of do. I think Nike got I'm surprised it. you're hitting on all these. Yeah. Or is it just not as uh, hard to hit anymore? Um, I don't think the the last two I showed you weren't hard to hit. Okay, so these these are these are pretty special to me. All right. So you actually have a pair of these. So we got. Oh yeah, these came in brown boxes. And price of? Uh, I think I paid, shipping was like 112. You know what's crazy? These actually held up pretty well over the years. Right, it got like a little bit of peeling right there on the, on the side, you see it? Yeah. A little bit. What other fruits did they do or is it just watermelon? They didn't do fruits, they didn't do many fruits. It just came out. Like a, two or three of them, right? Yeah, they did the patent leather shit, but it was like random. Yeah. I remember many fruits, right? I remember I think these. Then they had the Brazils, Pixies. Um, I don't even remember what color the Pixies were. Pixies are like a baby blue and green. They, they got a bunch of- This was uh, the the Bapes, the OG Bapes, the community always points to this era of right. Air Forces that th this was their response when Bape was blowing up. Right, right. It was like, oh, we, we can we make can start too, making yeah. super fancy colors and whatever, right. you know? Dope. The, even the Inso was different. It's such a grab because it's cheap. Or yeah. like, where I guess, you know, sure. rel bro, it's relative, it right? But I've been wanting these since high school, bro. I seen it for 100. I said, oh yeah, no, I need them. Yeah. They're not all like beat up and shit. And yeah. Crazy. I'm like, then you start looking at the Frankensteins. Yeah, the Frankenstein, the Halloween, I think I seen those for like 450 or some shit. Sheesh. Yeah. And then PlayStations go for like 30 grand. Yeah. These. Oh, I forgot. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I actually yeah, really want to see this. Uh, Drake knocked the Air Force One. Is it a different type of box? It looks uh, like a mint color. Yeah, it's like a mint blue. And then it, these are actually really nice. I was I was surprised on the quality. Actually, you know, honestly, I don't even know. Not so Nocto is a part of what? I'm assuming. I don't know this for a fact, but it's an extension of like OBO. Oh, I see. I see. But it's like their Nike collab. Like this is the first anything Drake to Nike that I actually like, which is funny because it's just an all white. But yeah. All, I feel like all the other Drake stuff that he did, I didn't like any of it. Yeah. Whoa, what the hell is that? Tell me, bro. You gotta really check it out, bro. Oh, more, shit. More than okay. And then check out the back, the back heel. Yeah, I saw that. Yeah, I mean. Uh, and that's pretty instead dope. Instead of it being a star count, it's actually hearts. I don't know if you realize that. Oh. See that? Yeah, yeah. They did that for the, va the Valentine's Day, too, right? No, they put the hearts up here for Valentine's. Oh, yeah. oh. And then look, even the, even the, um, the holes here. See how they're large, small, large, small. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It resembles the back tab. I wonder why they did an all white though. Like, I mean, it makes sense though. It's like, it makes sense. Like, yeah. Like, what other color would they do, right? Maybe all black. I can see them do all black. True, yeah. Drake shit is usually simple. Black and gold. Yeah. Normally. Honestly, I feel like, and I could be wrong, correct me if I'm wrong, but I feel like if you was to have a collab with Nike, it would It might be an all be white like or a this. panda. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? And then it would just have little subtle differences. Just do Superman or some shit. <laughs> Something so off. Right. <laughs> like, really, man? <laughs> For real? I think it's interesting, though, this being on the inside. I've never seen that before. Yeah, I have. So, yeah. I just, I always wonder how much of a hassle it is for Nike to switch and redo a sole like this, you know? Because, right. like, basically, if you did, like, Nike ID, Nike by use, right, it's right. just a stock of of whatever mold they have, but you have to do a whole new mold for this. Yeah. But, I mean, they got money, so it's not like... And, I mean, they're working yeah. with the biggest artist in the world. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah. You know yeah, what I'm yeah. saying? Like, yeah, they probably yeah. wouldn't do this for... I'm not going to name another artist, but... Yeah. For Drake, they'll do this shit. 21. Can you do <laughs> something? <laughs> Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is all more Nocta stuff? Nah, it's the OG uh, Albany. Oh, the original? Yeah. Or did they re well, redrop they, they, it? They recently the beanie. Yeah, I mean, I thought that was pretty cool. They, they feel like five, something you can just go buy. Five, six, no, it's not. Uh, uh, oh, man, some pandas. <laughs> <laughs> we, no, yo. we have pandas. Wow. <laughs> Fashion icon. <laughs> Fashion icon, bro. Oh, my this is Nike's hottest selling sneaker. Clearly not. <laughs> is your first pair before? Yeah, or? This is my second pair. Oh, okay. Honestly, this shit is just, this is just a quick flip, bro, honestly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fashion icon, bro, bro. <laughs> it's another sneaker that I went in high school, and I think that kind of birthed me into liking colors. We got these. Oh. Yeah, this is nostalgia for real. Yeah, bro. This is nostalgia for real. Citrus 7. With the Jabodes. You know, oh, absolutely. <laughs> Actually, quite possibly with a peacoat and a visor beanie. I'm, I'm just <laughs> I know Ruben was even talking about getting these and Izzy, too. Yeah. yeah. Because, you know what I mean? It just takes us back to high school days. Bro. Yeah. Like 2006. So. This takes you straight back to the time where you just look at shit on the internet that you can't afford. Yep. And we're hella fakes of these, too. Hella. Mad fakes of these. Hella. And the Oreos. You remember the see-through ones? This is like the wrong shoe to do see-through. <laughs> one to do it there's too many <laughs> is there? like, why, do you have, why is it see-through bro 
And how come the niggas that always wore the see-through shit had dirty ass socks? I never understood that. For a long time, I thought the see-through stuff was just fake. But uh, Nike actually did one. Air Force One. Air Force One, yeah. yeah, yeah. Then the fake company said, man, are you crazy. serious? Ooh, we can do that? Y'all don't even want leather? Right, it's even cheaper. Niggas used to hoop in that shit, bro. <laughs> Oh. Shit all foggy. Crazy, the steam room seven. The sauna fives. These are, got these off of Goat. Goat is always um, just so much more expensive, but I guess it's more guaranteed, right. I guess, maybe. These are the starfish. That shoe was inspired. Damn, um, this is soft. The Hermes bag. Oh. So, but no one talks about it. Like, yeah, I yeah. Know, I don't know if people just don't know. Fucking purse, look. It even has like a keychain. There's a keychain in here. I just think, you know, as a sneaker community, we should probably do justice and really like trying to figure out what the shoe is about, not just throw a label on it. Right, you know right, saying? yeah. All right, so now we get into some fun shit. Um, uh, I'll show that later. Uh, uh, um, they are the product. Oh my goodness. America Cups in the charcoal. Cups. Damn, damn. Sir. Wait, so this is, uh, cause I don't follow it that hard. I just know it for being in the store. And what, this is what's in the store right now, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, this is the, the new uh, iteration. Bro, I'm finna get one of these, they bro. Crazy, bro. Oh my goodness. They go crazy. Oh my goodness. So they, they did red, there. blue. They got, they got a lot of colors. Black. Bro. Obviously, they got red, blue, yellow, black, charcoal. They got all black. They got all black with red. Uh, they got navy. Which Are they comfy? Uh, I mean, yeah. Can, for I, can, can I try it on? Yeah, of course. Ooh. Ooh. This is a what size? Uh, oh, so they fit super big then. Oh, bra bra. <laughs> bad, bad. Yeah, actually they're not they're not that bad. Mm. Bruh. I like I like that it's like wide when you look down. I I think I think they make another one that's like really, really narrow. I think that was like back in the day or something. Right. Yeah. I don't know, I don't for whatever reason it reminds me of some kind of like rap album cover. I don't I feel like it's been in like multiple but <laughs> These are like the elevated Doughboy sneakers. Yeah, 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 yeah. You, know <laughs> you made like, it out. You exactly. made it out. <laughs> exactly. You know what I mean? Like, I feel like, you know, you got your you got your Doughboys that's in the hood that's buying all the Jordans, got all the fly Jordans and shit, and then you got the motherfuckers that live in the hills that's wearing these. Yeah, yeah. You know I mean? come back to the hood every once in a while. Everyone's with just to show their car. Exactly. Just to fucking ride through the hood. But yeah, I had to had to grab some of these. Those are you view me. It's a cool box too. Oh, it's like a nylon. Sick, man. Then we got this another one undefeated release this colorway on a dunk. Um, I happen to grab two pair of these. These. Oh, you haven't worn them yet, huh? Um, I have, I got two pair. Yeah. They do I seem thought, a little stiff. They are. Just, just, just they, by a little bit. They are, but you know, I wore these in Tahoe in the snow, bro. Oh, I saw that, the fit pick. Yeah, yeah, I saw that. that. <laughs> oh, going. Going. So, I want your thoughts on these. I mean, I like it, but I, I don't really wear these type of colors anymore. I fuck with it though. What do you think about the shape? <clears throat> like the too boxy or something. The the brim. Well, what size fitted do you wear? Because if you're like uh, a five, I'm a, seven, I'm a five eights. Oh yeah, this should be fine on you then. Bend it a little bit. Maybe I. I thought the brim was short. Oh, is that what you're saying? I thought you meant like it was too wide. Nah, like the actual. I've always liked the darker. Uh, Same. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not a big fan. But of I do want the. I still want this yellow camo in the snowboard. I still never owned a babe snowboard jacket. Oh, okay. I thought day. you meant the actual snowboard. I'm oh, like, no, oh no, no, shit. no, 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 no. But the original, you know, like the same one that Biggie wore. Right, right. I want that one. Yeah, I thought it was cool. You know, I mean, you, you know, you, you're Mr. Babester though, so I had to get your, your opinion. You know what I mean? I haven't My worn head. something that has like babe camo in so long. The last thing I own right now that's babe camo is a, a backpack. Oh shit! The one I wore in Hong Kong. Yeah, that was. This is my. This is one of my fucking holy grails right here. I done put miles in this guy. I totally thought today you were gonna pull up with the Louis because I saw you no. snap you. No, it was no, like, no, no, no. I was like Valley Fair, huh? I was like, I wonder, I wonder what's over there. Imagine though, just sitting on the couch in the fucking Louis. Yeah. Get on, well, just the shoes showing. That's what I'm saying. You know, I I ended up buying the linens. Did you? But. I bought it on Goat, and then they emailed me, and they were like, oh, uh, the box is damaged. You want to swap it? And I was like, yeah, let me swap it. And then they came back, and they refunded me, and they're like, sorry, we don't have a swap. And I was like, well, why don't you just give me the fucking fucked uh, up one then? Yeah, it's probably I thought I thought you had a one. Oh, dog. <laughs> Bro, I haven't worn fives in so long. Bro, they go crazy. Bruh. Oh, yeah, these fit, too. I like that it's like black, but at the same time, it's, like gray, right? it's not, yeah. I think it's the colorway too, though. You can pull off like, it don't look much different from it being brand new to this. Yeah, year. exactly. It's the same look on foot. Bro, every time I link with you, I end up wanting to get something. <laughs>
Because you were like, because when the last time I came, you were like, oh, let's go to Valley Fair. I'm like, you want to go? I was like, okay, yeah. Valley Fair is Black Friday. Hello. Uh, yeah, I'm already here. Okay, call me when you're outside. All right, thank you so much. Uh, so I have the um, electrician and the painter coming. Uh, sorry, the background's so messy. Um, I have the electrician and the painter coming to fix the room that I always film in um, next door that you guys have seen in the vlogs like a million in one time so but I'm, I'm changing kind of just the way that it looks making it look a little bit more clean cut a little more uh just professional so i'm gonna vlog the process and uh here's the footage so you like this kind or that kind oh, i like i like the one on the end then yeah, yeah 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 perfect yeah. information for the light bulb oh uh, for the phone app yeah uh, it's connecting it's loading in a second okay. You think so it's enough those? I think so. Yeah, it's a uh, yeah I think I think it's pretty bright. What kind of type job do you do? Uh, I sell like clothes. Clothes. Yeah, clothing. Oh, okay. Yeah, so like uh, jeans and jackets and stuff. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's why it's kind of soft. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> See it all here. <laughs> should, oh, I have to turn them all up. So okay. Oh, jeez. Yeah, oh, so they all have to yeah. be up on the on the app. First, I think I figured it out. Here. There you go. Oh, okay. Got it. There, there. <laughs> Got it. <laughs> but you can also control the temperature. Super orange, but I'm more in this area right there. Boom. Boom. That should go kind of crazy, right? right? Anyways, they're going to come. Uh, I got someone coming to paint the walls. Yeah, I'm going to get rid of that. We may or may not keep those lamps, but I gotta clear all this shit out. Yeah, mainly this this whole area is really what I'm trying to get at. So we're gonna paint them white. And I got the paint right here from Home Depot deal. You feel me? And uh, we're gonna get it how we get it, baby. They're coming tomorrow. So got, let's clear this out. Clean this whole room and now I'm cleaning it all over. Bro. <laughs> Bro. Within a span of literally one week. This room. So yeah. just painting this one. Yeah, so we're gonna paint the bottom with this and then the wall with this. Okay, so we're gonna start today and it will be done tomorrow because we're gonna fix all the dents. All these chicken stuff. Oh, okay. Okay, that's fine. Thank right. you. Let me bring this up. Okay. This place turned out really good. I mean, you can already see like the lighting in here turned out really good. And then also uh, I can actually turn on the lighting, more lighting off of my phone. 
and you can also change the colors and you can <laughs> you can make it like a disco in here also linking with Vel previously in the video you just saw um, he had the off-white fives and I went to I went to go get me a pair so this is a couple weeks later so I, yeah I had to get me a pair man like these are sick these are dope man like I don't you know I don't know what it was maybe I had to see someone wear it first before I went to go get my own because when I first came out I was just like eh, kind of what you know whatever it's cool um, I also haven't owned a pair of fives in a long time I gotta break these in though because I tried on the right side pink the pinky toe is getting murdered all right it, it is getting murdered in there but what's weird is I tried his on and it was cool and then I tried these these ones are brand new um and it's it's stabbing the shit out of my toe you know like Jordan brand please like let's do you know let's, let's do something about that I can't be the only guy complaining about that. As far as tomorrow goes, we got um, Tony coming from Fine Hidden from Santa Ana. If you guys don't know, that's an archive, or he, he owns a like an archive fashion resale type store in Santa Ana. He's been on the channel before, and uh, he's coming to the Bay, and we're just gonna kick it. We're gonna get some garlic noodles as, as usual. And then um, I did wanna kinda get him on the channel, get his take on what he thinks about archive fashion right now. And also, um, some of that Bella Kalala, you know what I mean? That Ben Salaga drama, you know what I'm talking about? <laughs> I want to get his take. I don't know. What would you think about it? You know? Uh, so yeah, anyways, we're going to see what he's talking about and let's run that footage. Oh, for sure. Appreciate oh, that. Bro, I love, bro, love your content. So you live around here? Or? Nah, I just came out here just to go talk to you. Oh, where are you from? Uh, I was going manual. Oh, can I take a picture? Oh, for sure. Yeah, you guys. Hell yeah, man. Thank Love you, your man. Content. Thanks for watching. Hell yeah. Yo, are you already uh, getting closer? Oh, okay. Um, okay, I'll, I'll be here. Ooh, like, where the f are these fools at, dude? How you doing? I was like, where are these guys at, dude? What's up, man? 23 miles, basically. Nice to see you again. How you doing? What's going on? Easy. Hey, how you doing? Nice to meet you. Welcome. Where'd you guys come from? Uh, yeah, we came from the office. But... So I normally get, uh, I get, normally get 45. So. <laughs> what is that? Yeah. It's uh, the garlic noodles. Yeah. Also <laughs> yours. I'm gonna eat all of it, bro. <laughs> That's really good. Wait, I have yeah? Alright, really bet. Who so? <laughs> Thank you, sir. You always have gum. I'm a gum fiend. This is my favorite gum. I discovered this out in Taiwan. All oh yeah, you went to Taiwan afterwards, right? During the middle of my trip. During the middle of your trip? Yeah. So I was in Asia for three and a half weeks. Spent a week in Tokyo. Five days in Taiwan and the other two weeks. And uh, I'm back in Tokyo. Wait, so did you... <laughs> is there like an archive community in Taiwan too? Is that what it is? Actually, um, Hidden's editor uh, is now based in Taiwan. Andrew? Yeah, Andrew. So it was cool. Oh, yeah. Andrew, I met him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's yeah, 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 yeah. Good guy. Yeah, he's uh, he lives out there now. Dude, I feel like anytime I, I see you guys' content and all that kind of stuff, like you guys are definitely one of the more focused archive -y type of pages that I follow. I mean, there's yeah. only so many that I follow. Oh, yeah. And, and also, I feel like the past, like, year or so it's been like super hot mm. and then like i don't know where where like where does it stand now like what what is the state of archive fashion? Of, i feel like from tony himself let's hear it let, let, let's hear it man it's like man. People, <laughs> people people take closely seriously bro i'm not gonna cap but it's hey like, i'm just saying though this shit was hot as shit what like, happened um I think right now it's still pretty good. There's a lot of people, because a lot of people that come into our store, a lot of them don't know too much about Arcat, but then because we have that opening, or that very inviting environment, and then people are open to learning. So is Archive just a category or is it an aesthetic? Oh, that's, that's I think, I think both. That's a real question. That's a good question, because I think it's both, right? Because there are certain Archive brands that have certain aesthetics such as um, there's dark core, which is usually consistent of labels. You think of like Yoji Yamamoto, certain aspects of Home de Gar song. That's considered archive though? Mm hmm for sure. So that's a whole well, I thought, dark core. I thought the reason I asked that is because mm -hmm. 
It's almost like the minute something is old, it's mm -hmm. archived. You know what I mean? I think. But but not but not all pieces mm -hmm. can be concluded. It's like is is old yeah. Ed Hardy archive? Like Yeah, you know that's you know what the, I mean? weird, the weird thing well, about food? archive is that there's a lot of it that it's very subjective, right? Super. Whereas with vintage, it's like there's a clear definition if it's I believe it's like twenty years plus is vintage. Right, right, right. Not uh, supposedly. Yeah, yeah, supposedly, right? Uh. Whereas it's not necessarily the same way of archive. Something could be just like last season. Last season Rick owns and then well, that would I think, still go in an archive. I think store. when the shit popped off, and I'm not the spokesperson for this shit, mm -hmm. but the way that I looked at it is when it popped off, mm -hmm. it seemed like it got so popular that people started making archive brands when yeah. when really that's like that's like starting a, a factory saying that you're gonna you're gonna manufacture antiques. Like how do you do that? You know? Uh, yeah. So that therefore it might have like created some kind of aesthetic, but so yeah. it's like yeah, it's like a little bit of both, man. Like and I think that's the appeal of it because it's so open facing. I don't think there's a clear definition to what makes like the It's aesthetic. like there is but there isn't. There is but there isn't. It's and also weird. it's so funny how things are decided, like what you said earlier, it's so uh -huh. funny how things are decided that it's archived. It, yeah. it, it, it's up to the community yeah. where it's like, it is. Uh -huh. and it's just, it is. Why? Because it is. Yeah. It's almost like buying Supreme in 2015. And like, it's it, cool. Why? Because it's, it's, it's Supreme. Cool. Yeah. <laughs> but then that's like, I think that that's more of a commentary on like the, the, the age we live in, right? Like, for instance, most influencers, why are they famous? They're famous because they're famous. Oh, yeah. Yeah. yeah okay. I, that's yeah. kind of like the age you live in, right? Yeah. Like, well, I'm not knocking it. I'm just saying. Yeah, like, it just that's is. just how it, it, just how how it is. is. Yeah. Yeah. Um, like, this one's cool because it's cool, man. I know. I just, or, or sometimes, you know what? One, one thing that kind of, no, it doesn't irk me, but it, it makes me think like with the archive community, quote unquote, huh. whatever the hell that is, is that yeah. when they, when they, praise this one piece because uh -huh. it's the first yeah when really the first one uh -huh. sometimes is trash yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, tra it's a trash ass piece yeah, yeah, yeah but it's like but it was the first but it's like i don't care <laughs> the newer <laughs> ones are better yeah like, no, you know what sure. I mean? <laughs> like the no, update sure. give me the updated version like bitch like if you bought like the first honda uh -huh. bitch i don't want the first honda mm -hmm. i don't i mean yes yeah, archive yeah. but bruh i don't know and then that's where it gets into like uh a lot of people that are into archive really appreciate the, um, the history yeah, again the historical yeah, yeah, yeah. cultural significance of certain pieces right like yeah it's the first it may not be the best but it's the first or the, you know the, the designer who made it was going through like was literally going crazy at you know at that point in time when they made this piece you know all, all these different things that play uh do, do you think them, like, that history do you think that some of those stories are a little stretched always but there's oh, some always? that do have Shit. i mean ev i think every story is always stretched to get people's interest right but i think there's still merit to a lot of these stories because all these stories of design of fashion of people just it's human right it's it doubles back to just what it means to be human and to have interest in the well, shit that we wear i, I asked that because like mm. a lot of those designers they don't say they don't go on interview yeah they don't talk about what they made they mm -hmm. just make it yep and then it's like mm -hmm. up to everyone else to decide yep. like oh it's about this when really yeah it's like well was it though are you sure about that yeah yeah exactly are you sure about that, a, bro? Lot, you a lot know, of this again that's i think that's talking another about these motherfuckers like they superheroes yeah, it's all it's all up to uh, interpretation because like you're right a lot of these designers don't have a lot of interviews so what do you what do you i know they were kind of flipping here but uh, yeah. what, what you think about the balenciaga the bensalaga man yeah, like, what you what you think the about the bensalagas bro what you about to, man, what's, the, what's the state oh, of bensalaga <laughs> oh i'm gonna really need to be careful about high words <laughs> I mean, I think what they did is obviously not acceptable, but I think too that. <laughs> Dude, man, man, I don't know, man. Well, what do you think, man? Mm. You're not like, the one that's gonna get canceled for saying nothing. They already uh, got canceled. Yeah, but having opinions out is dangerous. I mean, <laughs> whatever, bro. I, honestly, nah. I think it's I think it's super soft when people like yeah. keep turning to other people for what their opinion is about yeah. it. Why don't you have your own opinion on That's it? That's true. You know what I mean? Like, I don't really. I'll be honest. It's like I think there are way more pressing issues in the world. Than oh, for what sure. A, what a designer brand does. So if I'm gonna keep it a buck, I just don't care. Uh. Yeah. It's like it's like okay, they're doing something that's not. 
he, like, you know, it's not good, but it's like, I, I mean, it's my, a clothing brand. I don't really care. There's too many much. things about the situation that did not add up. Yeah. It didn't add up. Yeah. As a brand that, that hot, why would you have documents in there like that? Why? Why? I mean, yeah. I know you're trying to be edgy, but why? That doesn't make, that's, bro. You gotta think, it's gonna jump through multiple hoops it's, before yeah. you can get it pushed out. That's so what I was like, saying. There people yeah. who saw it, other people who saw it. It's and weird. And saw it on top of that, and they're still like, yeah, that's a good idea. Exactly, yeah. I mean, yeah. Apparently they were trying to say that, oh, like, we didn't know that those documents were actual, a real, they thought it was yeah. a fake document or whatever. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And also, like, the teddy Sweet. bear thing, bro, the teddy bear was in the runway before all of this. No one said anything about the teddy bear then. Mm -hmm. I don't understand. Why are you, what? But, again, those documents should have never been there, though. Yeah. You know? It's totally wrong. You know what I'm saying? I agree. Shit's weird. You, th you think people are going to get fucking ostracized for rocking Bensalaga? Nah. No? Nah? No. Nah. Because think about it. Oh, you, think, you think it's going to be hotter than ever? No. I, I think that because right now, people's attention spans are so short, right? Give it a few months, no one's going to care. People that do care. You think so people still look at v the same? Yeah. v still hot in a lot of parts of the world, even in Asia. So especially, it's like, there's, Asia. yeah, so there's, especially there are these China. pockets of communities. It's like, yeah, it's like, okay, we won't fucking these brands anymore, yeah. but there's still a whole other world, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, so they're, it's like, they're not, they're not caught up in the politics yeah. of, of what happened. Yeah. You know, back, doubling back to Asia, they don't give a f about politics and clothes, bro. It's just, yeah. Oh yeah. Definitely we not. want the branding, you know, we yeah. want the, you know, blase, blase. Um, Ben Salaga, bro. And, dude, that shit was funny, bro. This man pulled out like 16 <laughs> pairs of They're all reps. Renners. <laughs> pulled out like a DHL bag. <laughs> and then he said, and he had the I'll audacity. I only rock the Ben Salaga, Cash man. at me if I <laughs> <laughs> If you want me to stop wearing my Ben Salagas, cash yes. at me $5,000. Where did you find that video, bro? <laughs> bro, that was on Twitter. It blew up on Twitter. And it's like this oh. It's like this dude that he wears hella fake stuff. And he's, oh. he's on TikTok. I don't think he knows. Or maybe he does. I don't know. He totally knows, bro. Yeah, he's got to know. Because yeah. I, he has a whole table. I actually uh -huh. show you a clip. It's a whole table. Mm -hmm. And he has like APs, Rolexes, and like <laughs> Cartier. Like bust down watches. <laughs> that's bust down, man. Yeah, that's a real bust down. That's bust down, that's right? bust down man. I'm yeah. dead, bro. <laughs> I I'm only there. rock Ben Salaga, man. <laughs> I, I'm surprised that the whole thing just even went that far. Like, mm. like I, I don't, I don't even know. It's almost yeah. as if, it's one of those moments where like nobody in fashion has anything to talk about. So then yeah. the minute something like that comes out, it's like, oh my god, have yeah. you heard? It's like, okay. Yeah. And this, this is my take. I just think. We as a people, we're just focusing on the wrong things right now, for sure. It's like, why is this movie, like the forefront of like nationwide news? This yeah. and whatever the fuck. I mean, Kanye, it's a Fox News. Yeah, this and whatever the fuck <laughs> Kanye has to say, bro. <laughs> like no that man is just mentally saying yeah, he, he just dropped some bro. new music. <laughs> oh really? Yeah. It's yeah. fire. It's not like uh, actually he knows like one track, right? Uh, okay. Yeah. So, of course it's good. Yeah. It's, it's Kanye, bro. It's Ye. It's not even Kanye no more. He doesn't. He doesn't <laughs> go by Ye. Kanye. All right. Do you think Kanye That's has a slave has, name, bro? bro. My Whoa! Fault. My Whoa. fault. My fault. OG. Oh man, he changing his shit all the time, bro. Mm. No, but real talk though. What's up? Uh, Kanye's music as as of the past, like let's say even three years to now, do you feel like it has repeat value? Like you listen to it over and over. Oh yeah, I've been listening to. Yeah. I was alive last night. I still fuck with Ye music, of course. I mean, it's uh, there's many moments where it's hard to uh -huh. separate what he says uh -huh. to his music but then when you really listen to the music you're like this is just good music man that's facts you know what i'm saying i mean there's a lot of uh -huh. artists out there from way back in the day that did a lot of foul shit or maybe they you know they did a lot of things in the public eye that were not that great yeah and i, I know you don't listen to like bay or rap but like in the bay they got a lot of rappers that do a lot of shit where you're just like their shit was corny why'd you do that yeah, yeah but they're legendary you know because uh -huh. they made certain type of music back in the day and i still respect them for that but honestly you know, you can only respect people for certain things sometimes, you know? And yay is one where it's like, I don't know if I agree with a lot of stuff you say, mm -hmm. but you make fire music, though. I'm not, mad at, I'm not mad at that. Yeah, just doubling back on the art. I think that, I think his music's great, but I don't think it has the repeat value that it once had. Like For real? I can still listen to a lot of his older You don't like the yay album? It's like, I like Don the Bro, Bro, 
Oh, Donna's good too. That's good. That's good. Yeah. That's good. yeah. yeah that Lauren Hill uh, remix something. was good. But yeah, I don't know. I'm good with it. That dude fucking, he literally, he's so rich and so famous that he can like pick people out and just like work with them. You ever thought about that? It's like, yeah. oh, who's canceled? I'm gonna just go hit them up right now and go link with them right now. You see him like, on how could you? Are you, you see, serious? Do you see him on Infowars, bro? <laughs> There's no hoops that he has to jump through. He's just like, I'm Kanye West. Let's do something together. <laughs> and everyone's just like, yep. <laughs> Wait, what'd you say? You see him on Infowars? Yeah, I saw that. That was funny. Yeah, bro. that shit was hilarious. That shit was funny, bro. The fact that people took that so serious is ridiculous to me. It's ridiculous. <laughs> you, how do you? How, first of all, without Kanye on the show, how do you even take Infowars serious? <laughs> you know, but they were talking about like I don't even know, like robot flies and fucking gay frogs and shit like that. You know what I mean? Like they're making gay frogs, and you're like a dog. Alex, calm down, <laughs> Mr. Jones. <laughs> I'm dead. <laughs> <laughs> Joe Biden is a lizard. <laughs> shit like that. <laughs> like, bro, come on, man. Uh, you... Yeah. yeah. <laughs> And then it has like news, like effects. <laughs> I didn't know you watched Infowars like that, bro. Oh, bro, I, I watched his, um, I got really into his shit because yeah, yeah. I'm into conspiracies. I fuck with the conspiracies oh, yeah? for sure. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I what's, don't believe in them half the time. entertaining, right? It's super entertaining. What's your, favorite, like, what's your favorite one right now? Favorite conspiracy? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, well, I haven't kept up with the new shit, but like when I was watching it, it was all about like the the po the politicians uh -huh. like killing babies and draining their blood because you get Whoa. adrenochrome and you you drink the adrenochrome, which is the blood, you live longer. And they have oh, yeah. the sex rings with the pizza gate. Oh, pizza gate! You know what I'm oh, talking about? God. Yeah. The, why they order so many pizzas? See, we don't know. We don't know. And there's too many things now leading up. And then also they expose the e anyway. See, see what you see, 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 what, see what I'm saying? You don't want me to go too far. He's, you don't want me to go too far. Like, you got me the conspiracies but like i don't believe in them really like that mm -hmm. but it's just wild ass stories where you're like bro there's really people out here just running around with like entertaining this all day like that's what i'm saying adrenochrome <laughs> tinfoil hat people <laughs> oh the fit is nice it's like a rip stop yeah it's even got a strap. Oh, you've seen this already? I saw an Alton story. Yeah. Oh, shit. I turn around? There's another one, too. Yeah. He's on the Oh, that's tight. No, I want the purple liner. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's, yeah. that's his stuff. It's a different jacket. Oh, what the fuck? It's like a double pocket? Yeah, yeah, the pocket's supposed to be like this, but. They got one like this. And nah, then fuck it, dude. Leave like it, dude. <laughs> Archive, fool. They don't know nothing about that, bro. <laughs> intricate pockets that you don't need. Come on now, guys. Get with the program. You guys ever been to Benihana? Uh, I have when I was like younger. Yeah. yeah. It's uh, it's right on the right. Like you guys were gonna go to uh, Mari's. Just the type of situation he was in down there. So it's like, right. Kind of wonky. Oh, your size? It's my size. This is sick. I have this, but I have um, I have like a different version of it, and it's I have a twenty nine. What are those? Uh, uh, these? Yeah. Oh, it's but it's the it's the that. trouser. Ask if you can do a deal on these. Yeah. We're awesome. <laughs> it's right there. Yeah. So, so thanks again, man. Yeah. Nice Tell you. Nice Thank you.
<laughs> What's up, man? Nice to see you. I know. Hello. <laughs> nice to see you. When they first opened, they got all the they got all the good stuff and whatever. Oh, you guys just know your way around here already. What the hell? <laughs> I thought I was gonna have to tell you where to go. What's up, man? Nice to see you. How's it going, man? Easy. Nice to meet you. Mhm. Mm so this is like a large. That one is still like a doublet, so I think this was a triple. Size six, five. Yeah, that makes sense. I don't really like how the shoulders are going super square. Well, I have mine and I mean, mine's that wall right now. Yeah. yeah. It is nice, man. I think it looks nice. I like that the, the sleeves are like look a lot bigger. Yeah, yeah, so you can layer up with it. It'll get softer the more you wear it, too. With the Type 1s, because before they had the Westerna, it's a little bit more of a slimmer cut. It was like 700? 700? 7 or 8? I mean, the more you wear it, the more the shoulders will drop down. It's just mad, yeah, it's it's mad stiff right now. Here. It almost looks like a different color. Well, they updated these ones where the Wests are now um, black. Uh, so before the wefts were white and it was still the warps that were black. Yeah, yeah. It is cool, but I didn't really come here to spend 700 right now. You know what I'm talking about? I was like, he just wanted to come. I'm not, I'm not dropping 700 bucks. Like, not right now. Uh, that one almost looks more gray, kind of. Yeah, it's due to the, the wefts being white. Yeah. Let me see your bag, bro. This one? Dang fool, Check this out, bro. Dang. I forget the bag, bro. This was Mia's first ever cell phone charm on her flip phone back in the day. Oh, super exclusive, super rare. Yes, sir. Hand, <laughs> hand knit in Osaka, Japan. Wow. Oh, okay, okay, okay. You got over here. You over here just walking around with this shit on. What the <laughs> fuck, man? Was, how much is this? Like ten thousand dollars? No, no, that's like. Come uh, on, man. When I when I bought it, I think retail was twenty one hundred. Oh, for real? Yeah. It might be more now. I'm not too sure about this. Couple this years ago. like this kind of stuff. They just don't remake, right? They just make it once and then it's like whatever. Uh, this is just like an always in stock one. Don't hold me to it, man. I haven't stepped foot in a Chrome Art store in like two years, three maybe. But yeah, I feel like you don't even need to. You already know where to get all this stuff. I feel like I just have everything I want. You know? Yeah, yeah. Really that's dope though. Yeah. Cool. Are those supposed to be ghosts? Yeah, Ma Maraca? Yeah, there's beads inside. Check with the market. Oh, really? 500? Smallest one, 150. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> and then there's bigger ones over there. Why, do you, you wanted one? It's cute. It's cute. <laughs> Big old bro right here. Whoa. So you shake it and it makes, it makes noise. Now the kiddo's going oh, down for it. What brand is this or is it not a brand? It's um, just an artisan in Japan. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. well, it's like a Pokemon <laughs> that hasn't evolved yet, you know? Nice meeting you. Right. Take care. Hey. <laughs> My bad, bro. I just, I knew this would take the longest amount of time. No, it's all good. That's a really nice pair. That's what it's like, so it's like washed well. Mm -hmm. yeah. I think they, they tailored them, huh? Uh -huh. Yeah. Hey, we're at Cotton That's Sheep. Nice. Yeah, Marco, I think, had something like this. 130? <laughs> Joe Biden is a lizard. <laughs> They're making robot flies, guys. Oh, no, bro, that ruined <laughs> these for me, bro. I really, I was liking these. Like, the, the, the text make it look like a Taobao brand. I know, really. <laughs> Oh, shit, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Bruh, bruh. Hey, y'all yeah, don't know nothing about the. Y'all don't know nothing about this. What, no? How much? 400? 400 bucks, but that's like a... Don't you have like four of those? Listen, bro, that's a special pair. Is it? Yeah, it varies. Is yeah. it real? Mm-hmm. Well, I'm about to find that out. Absolutely, I do, yeah. Size is it? Nine. Ooh. That's me. That's a little... Something like that. Got that toe, bro. Don't you own those? They look pretty crazy uh, with the jacket. I know, it looks like it matches his whole fit, yeah, don't it? This guy's so elegant, man. You walk around over here, majestic looking and shit. Come on, man. Uh, this fool. What's the dude uh, from Looney Tunes? What, uh, who is it? Oh, really? Yeah. Like, a newer babe? Uh, Let me see. Me. Oh, it's a collab. Cortex collab. Whoa. Wow. Or actually, does that mean collab? Because you can just carry. get, yeah, you can just get Gore-Tex, yeah. I always loved Bape's um, zippers. They remind, those remind me of the ones from back in the day. Mm. That was YKK? Yes, sir. Yeah, of course. That's the real deal. This is like the smaller version of whatever you had on earlier. Dude, I wanted this so bad when I was younger, bro. 
How much is that? 130? 130. Uh, but this is just, this is a no-go. Super wide, the dude. No-go, no-go. That's like pajamas at that point, bro. You know, I like a, a wide neck, personally. Wow, you like a, a what? I like a wide neck, personally. <laughs> I like the loose dog. The fact that someone actually bought these is crazy, <laughs> dude. Is there any, like... I feel like when Adidas collabs with him, they were just like, what did we get ourselves into? We all don't know about these. <laughs> 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 it's like a size 15, dude. <laughs> Let's let's do a let's do a fit check, dude. Oh, Hold on, you'll be the first to use my the white wall, my white background. Oh, really? Hold on, yeah, because I have no one's used this yet. With oh. the drapey drape, that boy got the drape. Uh, top down. Yeah, so it doesn't matter. Visvin, Chamdo Parka, Visvum, reversible iris. Uh, this whole thing is just a, a mix of like the Goros type things, you know. What is it like an actual brand? Uh, yeah. So this one is Arizona Freedom. This one's Toddy and King. This one is uh. Oh, so it's like all mixed up. Yeah, this one's from Cotton Sheep. I don't remember the brand. It's one of their in-house brands. Um, the strings from them. Strings too. from Cotton Sheep as well, yeah. yeah. Um, Lady White Co. Lady what? Lady White. Actually, I don't know that brand, actually. They, like, recreate vintage stuff. So, like, this is, like, how a white tee would have been in the 1950s. Mm. But it just fits. I could tell by the collar. Right. It Very just, kind of human-made-ish, except they, like, exactly. they, like, double it up. Exactly, yeah. exactly. Exactly that. Um, this Vim. Just some raw denim, just some business raw denim. I think these are uh, R16s. Well, so did you feel me? Mm -hmm. Okay, mm -hmm. all right, mm -hmm. okay. And then uh, these boots actually, we just we just ran into these at a uh, Second Street today. Is that over there? Yeah. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> I cannot believe this. <laughs> wow. So what do you think about the boots? Do you like them? A no going? Oh man! Visvum decoy boots, man. This there you one of my go. Favorite Visvum boots. They shouldn't have been at Second Street for the how little I paid. Um, yeah, I'm gonna talk about. Them. That's dope that you actually got a deal there because I never really go in there and find deals. So like, yeah, you know. it's still a, a four hundred dollar boot. But, I mean, but that, what's the retail? Fourteen. I mean, hey man, you know what I mean? You know what Not saying? complaining. You know what I'm saying, bro. Not it's complaining. Still... They look good. Nice, there you man. go. Look at this. This is a very majestic fit. This is also the first deal I've gotten at Second well, Street. Very flowy. Very very drapey. Over it. <laughs> wow. Oh, I know these are Balakanana. Balakanamas. Balakanalas. Man, it's a sign that shit out, yo. Balakalamlas. Oh, no. Balakalala GF. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you got a pin drop. Pin drop. I don't know what that is. Oh, damn. Vietnamese restaurant has been open less than two months. <laughs> what the heck does that even mean? It's already doing a bang up lunch business? You read the second sentence? Bro. What does that even mean? Bang up. <laughs> 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 what are you? <laughs> what the f this guy? <laughs> Who taught you that? TikTok. Yeah, but they ain't got no San Francisco Red. Yeah, but San Francisco Red. Peep that. Peep that. Look, but San Francisco what? Red is like North Day, though, bro. Like back in the day, the North Days used to wear. Well, now, the now it's San Fernando, fool. <laughs> see? See this guy? This He's guy. something else. He's something else. I'm not San even gonna San Fernando that. Valley, fool. You've been reading too many comments. <laughs> I just dropped like a 150 milligram edible and uh, I'm feeling fucking zooted. Honestly, I'm, I'm feeling on the neck on the top floor right now. I'm about to design like 30 new fucking space cars and get us some Rs. You scooted the seat closer, bro. It's going to be intimate, man. I don't know. Well, I mean, on video, it looks too far apart. Oh, does it really? Yeah, I think so. Wait, what did you want? I don't fucking know. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I don't know how to do this. I, yeah, you do. You have a channel already. Okay, but like the reason I started this channel was so like people could get to, like a lot of people ask me questions. They just like DM me and they're like about Chrome Hearts. No, about like real life. Oh, yeah. really? Yeah. I mean, Chrome Hearts is cool and everything. Like I was into it for so long. I noticed you haven't been buying as much anymore. No, I mean even just the necklace is just yeah. You know what I'm saying? And.